Hello and welcome back to Technic Tutorials, your one-stop guide to learning the Technic Pack. I am Gary Reaver. Since the last video aired, there has been an update in the Technic Pack. We are now in 7.2. That's all wonderful and amazing, but it does have some uh, bad effects. It means that your previous world is now pretty much unusable. It's obsolete. It has ores that are no longer in the pack. And the the plus side of the update is that the Technic pack is now in 1.2.5. And of course, due to Sod's Law, days after it gets updated to 1.2.5, Minecraft itself gets updated to 1.3. But we shall continue looking on the bright side and this is just a little update video explaining what is now missing and what has been added. So cracking right along, there have been several mods that have been removed from the Technic Pack altogether. Forestry, as predicted, was removed. It conflicted with a couple of the things. It can be re-added but those conflicts will will come straight back again. To be honest, it's not a great loss. The only thing that's missing, really, the only thing that's that was good about it was being able to automate tree farms. But that isn't really a a really important thing. Particularly as there's another mod that's been added that is is very good for harvesting res resources like that. <clears throat> Next one that's been removed is really unfortunately Crafting Table 2 and I, I looked at why and it's because Crafting Table 2 is still stuck at 1.1 1 .1. um, and until that updates you won't be able to manually stick it back in. So I, I really hope that does update because it made the complicated recipe so much easier for mass producing like the uh, circuitry. Uh, another massive one that's been removed is millionaire. To be honest I don't know why that's been removed but I'm not that bothered. I didn't use it in the end. I had it turned off because it conflicted with Somnia. So I'm not really that bothered about it but if you loved Millionaire, maybe you'd be able to re-add it. You, you'd have to look that up yourself, I'm afraid. Next one is the Zeppelin mod. And this one I assumed would be removed because it was buggy as all hell. And I, I, it's a bit of a shame, but if it stops you from being tempted to waste all those resources, then I guess it's for the best. And the last one that I know of that's been removed, there could be others, but the last one is Hangable Maps. And Hangable Maps was a mod that I didn't really show you at all, but it's, it allows you to hang maps on the walls, put them on table surfaces, as well as it, it included such things as writable books, which have been added in 1.3, but that's not much comfort to Technic Pack users. And Again, that ha that's stuck at 1.1. Uh, I did check that one. But those are all the ones that I know of that have been removed. There could be others, like I said, but I haven't found them or noticed them. But there have been mods that have been added that weren't in it before, and a couple of them are a bit meh, uh, uh, but a couple of them are pretty freaking awesome, I must say. So I'll tell you about them and end this on a, a lighter note. First of all, there's there have been updates to a couple of the mods that have already that are already in it. 
There's uh, Thowncraft, which was pretty crap before, and that has now been updated. It, the V crystals flying around are now called wisps, and they look better, they look different. Uh, v crystals grow underground, you will encounter them. Um, this is what they look like. If you break them, they will drop two or three crystals. They are reasonably common, but do not go around breaking every one you see, because Thamcraft is a very environmental mod, and there are complicated things that have been added, like aura and taint. Taint is particularly nasty. There are also now these extra trees. This is a great wood tree, and they are huge. They are two by two, and they show up on the mini-map as grey for some reason. And I, I don't know much of their use. They are in Thamcraft, but I, I don't know what they're used for yet. There is also another tree, unfortunately I've cut down all the ones anywhere near here, which have bright blue leaves, and they are silverwood trees and they're used for good thaum magic whatever that means mo creatures has been updated bears and wolves now drop fur which can be turned into fur clothing which is perfect fur for me oh i love this bit look it's a fur thong The, the leggings are a fur thong. It's ridiculous, but yes, it's uh, fur. It's I think it's the equivalent of leather. So fur. So wolves and bears drop that. Wolves have been redesigned. They look strange. Horses have been redesigned. There are new creatures like undead horses. Uh, oh, another thing from Thaumcraft is that zombies now drop things like brains and skulls, which is used in Thaumcraft. Railcraft has been updated, so now the coke oven has a different GUI. This is creosote oil, so instead of having endless creosote oil bottles, you I think you now put a bucket in here. There. Yes, you, you get a, a creosote bucket, and you use this in the creation of things, I believe. However, can I, can I dump this? I cannot, I, I can't pour it anywhere. I don't know what happens when that gets full. Perhaps you can't use the coke oven until you empty it, which would kind of suck. But apart from that, that's the only change I've noticed so far in Railcraft. But onto the new ones. There is another rail mod that's been added, Steve's Carts, that adds lots of different kinds of, of carts, uh, including a drivable one. Oh yes, these are some of the Thaumcraft ones. Artifacts and uh, artifacts for the most part, they uh, are blisteringly common in dungeon chests, and these are the new kinds of crystal. The best addition, I think, is Mistcraft. If you've ever played Mist, the PC puzzle game, then you should at least have some idea of what this is. Mistcraft adds ages to the game. You create descriptive books and linking books. Oh, I'll do a video on them later. And these allow you to travel to different ages which have particular qualities. For example, this one, they're randomly generated, but this has got hills, hills and forests, as well as all these particular things. And then you click that panel and you go to the age. 
and that is pretty much all that has changed in Technic Pack 7.2. This is my new place, this is new Reaver Corp. I shall be updating again now that I'm back on my feet. So thank you for watching, please subscribe and favourite and all of that. Bye bye.